Style Life was founded on the notion it's more about personal style than conspicuous consumption. Style Life has a belief that it's not how much you have, it's how much you enjoy what you have. When you walk into Style Life, it's different. It's not about what comes off the runway. It's taking a look at what are people feeling, what's moving them. My philosophy is really about owning your own voice in fashion, whatever that is. And I wanted Style Life to be the kind of place that you can actually create that. With the Summer of Tennis Love promotion at Style Life, we are able to present Jeannie and the organization with a check and then say, by the way, we have an idea. So he had this idea of, of creating an evening where we had the residents come in. We wanted the experience similar to when you walk into Styled Life and you feel special. There's as many reasons to think that a fashion store with uh, wardrobe consulting wouldn't necessarily coexist the way it does with perspectives. But it's just through dialogue. It's through communication. It's through asking questions. What are their needs? It wasn't about just helping them out with product. It was trying to figure out how can we use our talents with all those talented people and all the people who are focused on helping the women and helping the program. We have you know, terrific team members from Style Life, volunteers from Perspectives, volunteers from our own circle of family and friends that come out and they create the boutique. We bring in rolling racks, we bring in full-length mirrors, the music, we get the accessories out, display the accessories, put the clothing together by size. We'll go through all the donations to make sure that it's only clothing that's in perfect condition. If it's not new, it has to be in perfect condition. Well, women are, you know, they're leaving with their Armani jacket and their Gap, their Gap chinos, and, you know, with their Prada shoes. They may even know the designers, they may not. That's our ability to kind of snub our nose to, you know, the whole elitism in fashion and say, it doesn't even matter. This is just about facilitating this beautiful night through open closets. One thing that we are certain that when they do leave, they feel terrific about their look. The women are working so hard to put their life back in order, and they're doing all the hard work and all the heavy lifting, and they're working on themselves on the inside. And whether we like it or not, there's a, there's a world out there where how we present ourselves matters. If we can just facilitate a little bit of like looking in the mirror and standing up straight and saying, I look really good today, that, is the magic of what we're helping with. We're being thanked <laughs> for bringing out a rolling rack of dresses and shoes by somebody who is working so hard to stay clean and sober, to get their children back, to get their GED. That's where the real thanks needs to go, is to these women.